prepared speeches round. Our first speaker is Toastmaster Srinidhi, and her speech evaluation will be read out by Toastmaster Himant. My speaker, Toastmaster Srinidhi, is attempting her icebreaker speech from Pathways Innovative Planning. The purpose of this project is for member to introduce herself to the club and learn the basic structure of public speech. Srinidhi's speech is turn the pages. Time of peace note, the speech timing is four to six minutes. I wish my speaker all the very best. Thank you, Mahesh. Toastmaster Shmiti, turn the pages, turn the pages, Toastmaster Shmiti. Thank you, Toastmaster Dre, and thank you, Manshu. So, has anybody here heard of the Netflix documentary called Making of a Murderer? Okay. So, I would like to take inspiration from that title, just the title. And share making of Shinobi Shakti. Page one, my folks. My parents were born and brought up in Udupi, Karnataka, but I am a Mumbai girl at heart. We have a matriarchal family system, so women are the head of the family. So even before Nairobi from Money Heist, we were the OGs who celebrated. Let the matriarchy begin. Page two, my first born. No, I'm not a single mother. At least not yet. But my younger sister is 11 years younger to me. I practically begged my parents to have her for me. <laughs> From changing her diapers to teaching her the ABCs, I have done it all. No offense to my future kids, but she will always be my first one. Page three, the juicy bit. So this guy from college who was a common friend, I hated him since the first week of college. He sang Channa Mereya and uh, <laughs> made me cry about getting over my once upon a time beloved. He was like Jake Peralta and I was like in Santiago from Brooklyn Nine-Nine. <laughs> the thing about people who are constantly at each other's throat is that they push you to be the best version of yourself. When college ended, I realized that you miss some friends a little bit more than the others and the whole will they, won't they became crystal clear. I am glad that I had this just a good friend. Page four. The other love. No, I'm not a cheater. At least not yet. <laughs> but fun fact about me, I can speak five and a half languages. That's English, Hindi, Marathi, thank you to State Board and my neighbors, Tulu, that's my mother tongue, Kannada, because my parents only watch Kannada news in Sarigamapa, and Spanish. I completed my A1 level four years ago. We did have La France. French in school, but college did not have language as a part of its curriculum, thanks to our education system, which said that maths and science is important. That's when I realized that I love learning languages, and I hope to get back to learning Spanish soon. Page 5. Injury at 13. When at 13, other people were hitting puberty and getting their first crush on, I was busy hurting my back and getting a belt on for it. I was part of my school's athletics team. And one day while training, I started experiencing severe back pain, which required immediate medical attention. The doctor suggested that I stop training so as to not aggravate the matter, and my very paranoid parents could not have gotten on board any quicker. I've quit training now, but I wish to start training for one of those Mumbai marathons soon. Page 6. The career talk. For most of us back at home, our moms make the budget. But when it comes to these big money matters, Women are mostly kept aside. Taxes and finances are not exactly ladylike skills, JC. That's when I decided to pursue CA. I'm on my way to get that prefix, but read my mom's taxes or my dad's portfolio. I have a say in it. Over these years, I've come to understood, understand that personal finance is not exactly just for the finance folks or the men of the house. And I have taught my sister the tidbits about finance so that 13 year old can give you a talk about Nifty or Sukanya Samriti. Page 7, her low corporate life. This was back when I was preparing for my CA IPCC exams, and on my way to college, I could see this Deloitte building. 
I looked in that building and wondered if I could ever clear my exams and get there for artificial. Call it the subconscious part of my mind or just surreal. I made it, I cleared my exams and I made it to Deloitte. I thought that it would be like the television show shoot, uh, like the television show, sh like the television show shoot. And I would be like Mike Ross and I would find a mentor like Harvey Spector. But that belief was debunked real soon. <laughs> Page eight. Non-vegetarian, turned vegetarian, turned confused. <laughs> For the first 22 years of my life, I was a hardcore non-vegetarian. In the 2020 lockdown, I decided to turn vegetarian. In the 2021 lockdown, when me and everybody in my family tested COVID positive, my still very hardcore non-vegetarian parents told me to drop the I am a vegetarian act. It's 2022 and I'm still trying to figure out where I fall on the spectrum. Page 9. Toastmasters. Even though I hated the 7 a.m. lectures and the compulsory attendance that we had at NM College, that's where I met our VP education once she got to one of the college clubs. I saw her posts through social media about Toastmasters and voila, here I am. I am a barrel of excitement and everybody here is a sea of wisdom. I look forward to learning from each one of you and let me know which page of my life would you like to turn to and reread. Toastmaster of the day, back to you. So I'm calling the first evaluator uh, who will be evaluating Srinidhi's speech. So Himanshu Mehta, can you please have you on stage? Himanshu Mehta, evaluator one, evaluator one, Himanshu Mehta. Good afternoon, Toastmasters and guests. Hola in Spanish. Your speech was certainly a barrel of excitement. Congratulations on completing the icebreaker speech. Your first speech at Toastmaster, the goal of the evaluation is to give member an effective evaluation of his of her speech and delivery styles because the icebreaker is the first project uh, a member completes you took us all down the memory lane page after page where you were born how you grew up how well you did nursing and babysitting for your young sister, 11 years younger to you. Your speech had all the flavors of emotions, pain, pleasure, courage. To all of us, it felt like listening to a very interesting biography, turning page after page and very smoothly very smartly summed up just in six minutes. That was great. The body language was great. And especially the hand gestures were amazing. Now comes the anomaly. Some suggestions you may want to work on. Using the space available here on the stage, moving on the left two steps or the right two steps would really pull the audience more, make them more interesting. And because most of the time you are center focused on the, in the center, so probably it's an addiction on the online sessions here. Yeah? Eye contact from left to right to center would have engaged the audience more and maybe made it more mesmerizing. These two suggestions can give you a great mileage on your pathways going forward. All in all, a great speech and amazingly executed, you will certainly have a great going with Toastmasters. 
the usage of English. Um, so Srinadi had a ton of them. Let the matriarch begin. Uh, belief was debunked soon. Where where I fall in the spectrum. So can we call uh, so Abhiraj? Abhiraj to give the award for the best. With that, I call uh, Gaurav on stage, and we got a result. And best speaker of meeting number seven forty four is Toastmaster Sri Nidhi. Oh, no, 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 And 